The last thing that I want to do once we've got our scene finished and we've rendered out some still images as well is come in and just go to File, Export a Marmoset Viewer. So what this will do is then, uh, okay, I'm just going to put it to my desktop for now. That's fine. Um, textures and reasonable. I'm going to crank it up. Why not? Lossless normals. There's no animation. I can say, yeah, high res thumbnail. Just sticking it all up to maximum because why not? Um, and then this is the width in which it will open up, which is okay. Um, I don't want full frame. That's fine. And then I'm just going to hit export. Won't take too long to do. And please note that the export, it will open up the start from wherever your camera is set currently. So whatever you have it set, you want to get it in a nice kind of composition um, initially. So if I just minimize this, bring over the file that I've just exported, then basically if you have Marmoset Viewer, which I will have, so this is what I would like you to export. So then when I um, grading your work or looking at your thing, um, inspecting it, this is what I get. So let's just open that full screen. Now I can see your model and I can move this around interactively, which is nice for just a click. I can then come in and expect. I can also move the light around as well so I can kind of get a good look at things. Um, and what's really nice about this as well for me is that I can come in and it will give me the breakdown. So I've got your normals. So I can inspect how that looks. I can also come in and see just the albedo color and how that looks. And then, oops, I've got the reflectivity. So you can see all the areas which are actually reflecting light. So these are all the different maps. And then there's a kind of glass or roughness and topology, which is a really important one for me to have a look at just to see how you've kind of structured things and see if you are um, keeping. So I can delete those to be fair. They don't need to be there kind of thing. Um, and just making sure that we've got everything down. So you can see down the bottom here that it is uh, 4,000, just under 5,000 verts. Um, so it's 6,000 triangles, um, which is pretty good. I'm okay with that. And I could reduce that some more by deleting those edges out in all honesty. Um, and we could perhaps look at somewhere else where we could reduce. So I know that we could reduce this middle. We could take out that middle line altogether. Um, so that would reduce some, definitely. And could these be reduced some? Probably. Um, but for now, I'm OK. We can see how that's been reduced and I'm OK with that. So and then we come in and then I can see the final finished thing to inspect, which is great. And then that can be uploaded onto ArtStation or wherever it is that you need to. And submitted for inspection or uh, assessment rather.